Hi and welcome to this tutorial. Here I'm going to show you how to create links between all of the worksheets in your workbook. Which is basically going to allow you to um, navigate in a more aesthetically pleasing way and it's going to be a lot easier to switch between worksheets. Um, if you'd like to get this workbook and download everything you see here, go to teachexcel.com, search for the video tutorial and you can get it all there. Now to show you what I mean, I've created three buttons one for January, February, and March, and those are the three tabs that I have down here, January, February, and March. Um, so assume that you had them one for every month, and uh, it's kind of annoying to have to go down and click the tabs each time. So if you click any one of these links, it automatically takes you to the correct tab. Just like that. And the links look like buttons, so, you know, it looks pretty good. And um, even though I only have three tabs here, if I had say 50 or 30 or 31, one for every day of the month, I can make a little calendar and click every individual day to get to each day of the month. Um, and I'll probably show you how to do something like that in a later tutorial. But for now, let me show you how to create these buttons and how to add links to them so you can um, select the different tabs in your workbook. Now the first thing is I didn't actually create real buttons. So when you click on them, nothing really happens or you don't visually see anything. What I did was go to the insert menu, shapes, and then I selected this rounded rectangle right here. Once you do that, go to anywhere on the worksheet and draw yourself a button. By default, it's gonna look something like this. If you want to change the appearance of the button, simply go up here. Uh, if the menu isn't here because you clicked off of your button, all you have to do, click the button, go to the Format tab, go in Shape Styles, click this, choose a style, and there you go. Start typing, and you've got a button, just like that. So it's really easy to create a nice looking button. Now the next thing is to create the actual link. Uh, before that though, I'll show you how I quickly, how you can quickly make a bunch of other buttons exactly the same size. Simply right click, copy, then you can paste, make as many buttons as you'd like, and um, fill them in for the rest of the months of the year. But for now, let's just work with the January button. Now to make this automatically go to the January tab, simply right click the button, then go down to hyperlink, this window is going to open up. Oftentimes when this window opens up you will not first see this screen. What you do is go to the link to box in the left and select place in this document. Once you click that you'll see something like this. If you have a bunch of named ranges or defined names make sure you scroll all the way up to where it says cell reference and you will see the names of all of your worksheet tabs. Simply select the one you'd like and click OK. When you're done, every time you click on the button now, it's going to automatically go to that worksheet. So see, it was pretty simple, pretty easy, and it doesn't take that long to do. And it can really make navigating um, large and complex workbooks quite easy. And um, if you wanted to make it even easier to use, what you would do is on <clears throat> every individual tab, you would have another button that says back to main, you know, the main tab, or you would have a button for every month listed on every tab. So you could click to every month depending on where you were. Or no matter on where you were in the worksheet. So that's pretty much how you do it. If you'd like to get the workbook, go to teachexcel.com, search for the tutorial, download it there. And otherwise, that's it for this tutorial.